of restriction. Deliberate restriction. Please subscribe to the Demi Fruitful channel. Essential for a smooth walk with God. To succeed in life, sir. <laughs> a life of no boundary is a life without victory. You must place boundary on your life, sir. Even if you are a medical doctor, you can become a victim of sickness if you are careless. That you read medicine in school does not guarantee health if you are careless. That you read banking and finance does not guarantee prosperity if you are a waster. You can be a broke banker if you can't save. Understand the law of restriction. Boundaries. Some of you financially are so careless. You are carrying your ATM everywhere as if it's cheap dancing title. Carrying your empty ATM everywhere as if it's, a, it's eternal life. Sometimes keep it at home. I purposely refuse to learn how to transfer money online. I purposely refuse to learn it. Because that's one of the easiest ways to be a waster. Papa, bless me, bless me, bless me. I say, I don't have anything with me. Papa, transfer, transfer, transfer. I say, to which village? <laughs> to which village do I transfer you to? See, that's not what I mean. I mean, transfer something. I say, I know Sabio. I, I know Sab I don't know how. I'm, and may I never know. In the name of the Father, may I not know. In the name of the Son, may I not know. In the name of the Holy Ghost. I don't know westers you see this you buy you see that you buy no boundaries no restriction there should be a time limit when nothing must enter your mouth 18 11 p pm 12 am what is it you carry coke oh go 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 you carry fanta you go 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 you carry you carry this one go 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 you carry straw you didn't turn on the cup you put that you carry a um, pack of juice and put direct straw direct entry you put it like that you finish it and you are betting like an animal no restriction a very scattered life A life without boundary has no definition. Every feed is called a feed. What makes it a football feed is goalpost. Nobody's getting me today. Every feed is called a feed, but it is only where there is a goalpost you call a football feed. Life can't give you definition except you place boundary. Sir, there are times you must not pick call. There are times you have to sleep. Someone said to me, I was calling you 2 a.m. It was an emergency. I said, it is better that I sleep so that I don't become an emergency. <laughs> it's better I sleep so I don't become an emergency. There's nothing that will happen to you in this life eh, that will make me pray for you in my house. In this life. Even if you are dying, they will carry you to church. I will come and pray for you in church. My house is for my family. You come to my gate, you won't like you won't like what you see. I'm saying it in advance. It's a decision I made when the ministry grew to a level. Before I, I would pray for people morning till night. Morning till night. When the ministry grew to a level, the Lord said, Stop. I stopped. You must understand the place of boundary. There are people you should not talk to. Not that, not that you are enemies. You're talking to them does not bring anything good. It's always wahala problem. Wah cut off. We are not enemies. We are just mere acquaintances. We no be friend. Set boundaries, sir. Don't be casual to life. God said to Adam. Do not eat of the tree of the good of knowledge of an evil. Adam avoided the tree. He 
thief started playing around the tree. Started playing around the tree. Proverbs 6 27. Can a man carry fire in his bosom and not be born? Born, 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 should not give me headache you are calling me 1 a.m how much does he have to my account no amount call the call you can't give me money don't give me headache okay i'm i'm, I'm talking too much let me round up on is not an accident it's a product of lack of restriction sin is a product have you seen the nonsense going on today in the body of christ even in the church see comedian they will climb they'll climb water hey somebody now see jesus he now say bros j can you imagine the nonsense joking with the almighty you can't try that in islam you can't try that in islam that you crack a joke with muhammad they will behead your parents They will behead your parents. Somebody will come to the altar and he says, A comedian. He says, Hey, can I, professor? Play with gift. Can I, professor? Hey, you. I see you. I see you. <laughs> I see you. Your eyes turning you. God says, Not attack. Go out, buy bread and chop. And people are clapping for the, for the, for the malu. Joking with gifts. Joking with a prophetic gift. Joking with worship songs. He put his own inside. And he start, and we are clapping. People that they should off the sound system. Turn the sound system off. And some two young men, like the one that carried Ananias and Sapphira, should bundle him from the altar. And say, when you are ready to use your craft sensibly, come back. There's a way to get healthy jokes that will glorify God. Not nasty jokes that ridicule men of God. Nasty jokes. No restriction. Just open your mouth. Blah, 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 blah. You see all kinds of things. Am I communicating here? We should understand the law of restriction. Understand the law. The truth about man is that man has capacity to live in restriction. It is just deliberate indiscipline. No matter how thirsty you are and there's no water, you don't drink kerosene. No matter how thirsty you are and there's no water, you don't drink fuel. In the midst of your thirst, you have capacity to hold yourself from fuel. Meaning there is something inside you that when you choose to be disciplined, you can I'm sure my biological children, they are sitting here, listen to me. I'm sure if they ask them now, who is your daddy's friend? I'm sure they will crack their brain. <laughs> the 
divine is saying nobody. They will crack their brain. They will think, 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 think. Friend, friend, friend. Friend, oh, friend, oh, friend, oh, friend. You have, a, you have a house as a pastor. Your house has become a gossip site. This one is coming. This one is leaving. This one is coming. This one is leaving. This one is coming. Your children are the umpires, the referee, hearing the latest. And they are losing. Eh? Eh? You are raising up rascals. Raising up rascals. There is nothing bad about church your children don't know. They are growing up to keep malice. Look at the look at the rascality on your fingertips. Some people can be sending messages in their sleep. They are typing text. I should round up, right? <laughs> hey, because you are, you are a rap artist, so you must dress like Lucifer. You are a rap artist, so you come to the altar, dress so stupid, nasty hair, carry one torn jeans, put your trousers on your waist, and you are singing to glorify God, looking like a criminal. Go and see current day rap artists. They appear well. You see them well suited. Ah, yes, they will not wear a tie. Those who are still doing jeans and doing hair are those in the garage. Are those who are singing for the club. Okay, since that is how it has been, why not you redefine it by your appearance? You may not like what I'm saying, no. If we want to be Christian, let's be Christians. If we don't want to be Christians, let's close church and go home. Look at some people that call themselves Christian rap rap artists. They will sag their trousers. If only you know what sagging is. They don't sag in civilized places. Sagging is for prisoners. Sagging is not for sensible people. When they arrest people in Europe, they remove their belt. So they don't use the belt to strangle themselves in cell. So they are left with their trousers and it's just dropping down. That is the history of sagging. So if you are sagging, you are saying you are still in prison. Yo, Jesus boy, man, Jesus boy in the house. You can do that with a nice suit. You can do that looking well. You can do that looking good. You can do that with a nice shirt, nice trousers and good sneakers. Not torn, torn. You tear the trousers, tear the gown, tear the jeans. They come to God's altar that looks so organized and structured. With your torn clothes. God hates tongue clothes. When Adam, Adam, when Adam sinned, God covered him. God clothed him. Glory be to God. I said, Glory be to the Lord. Mm. True Christianity is not when a leader raises followers. <laughs> True Christianity is when a leader, a leader raises leaders. Am I talking to somebody here? The reason we have problem in church is that many pastors have refused to be leaders. They remain employees. So if you don't give them, there's a problem. You don't help them, there's a problem. You don't support them, there's a problem. I call one of our pastors here. I say, can I ask you a question? I say, yes. I say, yes. I say who they give me? Since I must always give you, who's giving me? Have you not asked? Yeah, Papa, you are, ah, Papa, you are, ah, Papa, you. As you don't understand, the bigger your head, the bigger your headache. A leader raises leader. Grow. You're a member from a church and you are angry that nobody came. I was sick, they didn't come to see me. I was bound, they didn't come to see me. My mother breaking wings, they didn't come to see me. My mother breaking ankle, they didn't come to see me. The other day said, I carry over in my school, they didn't come to see me. Even my phone said, if all the screen blank, they didn't come to see me. The other day, I was cooking Uba rice, Uba rice, Uba rice, a bomb of fire. They didn't come to see me. I was pounding yam, I was pounding yam, I was pounding yam. Even my heart, was it, 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 I told Pastor Wife, they didn't come to see me. Sir, 
Ma, why is it all the bad problems of life? Why is it always you that is happening to? Would you ask yourself a question? Fashito Krabadash. Kakruda Gadash. <laughs> Somebody say restriction. I can't hear you. Say restriction. Say it again. Say restriction. One more time. Say restriction. Again, say restriction. If, when, when, when Solomon started and living a restricted life, we can see an uncommon display of courage. Solomon was so loaded with wisdom that all those that fought his father became students in the school of wisdom. But when Solomon lost the law of restriction, battle came. Lost the law of restriction, battle came. Don't fight over anybody. I'm saying this to you, lady. Any man that enters your life, you discover is getting involved with too many people. Leave him. Maintain your sanity. Am I talking to somebody? Don't create any meeting for a man that will definitely not be with you. Leave him. Anybody that wants to make you an enemy to people. Just quietly. You don't need too many issues. Your phone is ringing every... You see, your phone is ringing every minute. It doesn't make it busy. It's not many calls. It is who called. Cockroach will call you. Lizard will call you. Tolo Tolo will call you. Backbaya will call you. Hey, 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 God. Sir, have you discovered that great men don't get much calls? Stay around big men. Your phone only rings. Not everybody has the number. Can't even get the number. If you have nobody, they don't have time to talk to you. Hello? Hello? You, morning tonight. Hello? Hello? Eh? 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 eh. Eh. Uh, okay, oh, oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. I have another call. I have another you hold on. Hello? Eh. 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 Hold on, hold on. I was on the call before your call came in. Uh, like I was saying. Eh. Eh. Two phones are ringing. They say, as far as you are concerned, you are busy. <laughs> Look at you. In your, in your heart of heart, you are very busy. You are very busy. See, see? That's how my phones are ringing. No? Hello? Eh. Eh. One dime, it doesn't add to your bank account. I'm telling you, whoever does not give you money should not give you headache. Pastor, any member who has an entitlement mentality, don't sacrifice for. You have entitlement mentality. You ask for help, we didn't give you. So because of that, you didn't come to church on Sunday. You will never get that help. The money your village people gave us to start church, you will bring it. You will never get that help. You ask for help because we didn't give you Sunday, we didn't see you. The other Sunday, you talked to two choir people, they followed you. The other Sunday, you told your family not to come. The money your village people gave us as board of trustee, when we are starting the church, you will need to produce it. You will help such people and they will still live. Don't waste your investment. Don't waste your investment. There are people that stop this church because they asked me for rent. And I told them, we don't have money now. We are building. They stop church. There was one I saw one day. I came for life in this place. I saw him in church. I said, you come back. Remain small. Remain small. I tell you, follow me, follow me, follow me, follow me, follow me. Follow me to the gate, follow me to the gate, follow me. Alele. God didn't come to save the world. Oh. God come to save my world. Not the world. My world. He sent me to my world. Not to the world. Why are you looking at me like that? If I preach to everybody, who, who will you think about preach to? If I preach to everybody, who will great other men of God preach to? No, I can't heal everybody. I'll pray. You are healed. You are delivered. You are, you are those saints. 
and those God has sent to you or sent you to must understand your language my sheep hear my voice see and everybody's having entitlement mentality last two weeks somebody gave me first fruits 120 I collected it innocently blessed him as a prophet and a priest of the house two days later he sent me a text he need 260 and I said your 120 is still there come and take it go and add to it you drop your first fruit and you want to collect my first fruit Okay, you want to you want to collect the rest fruit. Papa, but I dropped my first fruit as I stay in the office. I didn't go with it. So when you come, I will give you, you look for the balance from somebody else. And you call ah, Papa, no now, no now. I said, Why are you so wicked? Why are you so wicked? Today. You almost have to bribe some members to keep them. You almost have to bribe them. You finish having the queue. I don't have to fail. They'll meet you. Pastor, I'm going home. You are blessed. I say I'm going home. You are blessed. I'm going home. You don't know your address again. Why are you telling me? Don't. <laughs> don't. <laughs> All right, let me round up now. <laughs> Praise God. When Samson was born, there was restriction. Do not drink wine. No razor must touch your head. You cannot, you should not touch a dead animal. Samson lived a life of restriction because he was in Nazarene. You must get to understand. Select your friends. Select your friends. Do not let your friends select you. Select your friends. Anyone who you feel in your spirit you are not settled to be around please don't try to explain why you should disobey the nudging you are having in your spirit select your friends am i talking to somebody here select if you have been ordained in this ministry please thank god Before I put oil on your head, in this like me, I will look at you like this and design you. I will look at you like this and design you. Even if there are 500 from branches, they will bring them. They will keep them in a room. I will look at all of them first. This ministry, you will see now. I will look at you in the Holy Ghost. This one, this one. Out. 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 Come in. We have to pick you that you go and give my son's problem. You can't become a problem to my pastor. Not all of them can handle what I can handle. You go and give them problem and become a, 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 a situation. Dickin winch, dickiness wizard. I, we will pick you before oil come on your head. I said it to the Lord. I said, Father, as you give me bread, before oil comes out of my hand on anybody's head, one full day. Of vetting is vetting day. It's the day of vetting. I will see. I know the rush. Morning to night, we'll sit down there. If I'm tired, I rest. I go, we'll come back for afternoon session. We sit down again, we start vetting. So if you bring 700 and I permit only 70, I will tell them I disqualify, not pastor. Pastor love you, but I say not now. There's still something you God wants to do go the lord told me so your problem that you are having is the entry you accepted all kinds of people you made it too easy when you made it too easy many became entitled am i talking to somebody here somebody say restriction you will see the glory of god even without asking when you begin to live it, there's some music that must not enter your ear. 
Somebody is using the phone. Oh, baby, baby, baby. Oh, baby. Hey, 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 hey. Hey, turn that thing down. Turn, turn it down. Not you are there. Ah, uh-uh. ah. What kind of yeah, yeah, music is that? Hmm, ah, wow. And you are there hearing to hear. Yeah. Once you enter your spirit, you'll be shocked in the place of prayer. You'll be hearing, baby, baby, baby. <laughs> in the place, <laughs> in the place of prayer. Why? It has entered your subconscious. Are you following what I'm talking about? Keep your heart with all diligence for out of it i told you when i was in the institution i i lived in the house with a man eh? i was downstairs he was upstairs i'm worshiping god in the morning and i'll just hear i say sa 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 you are disturbing me now wait till you pay now nah, pay oh. do they pay for your room and they pay for my room once i start 3 a.m mashakalaba regada right left i say ah, ah. guess what every night i let there, i started going to a brother's house to sleep so that i can pray and in the morning when he's gone to work he's a thrift collector those that go from house to house collecting thrift when he's gone i'll now come home and be praying in the night he will play that music auto auto reverse not to reverse play to drop play I say, Father Lord, what is this now? But that was that was a devil planted. <laughs> and guess what? Then when I'm going to school, in my head, oh, you are, you are not you are not being honest. Though. That's what happens. Oh, unconsciously, 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 it just comes. I rebuke you. I rebuke you. I rebuke you. <laughs> I rebuke you. I rebuke you. When you are just sitting on your own, I say, bind you, I bind you, I bind you, I bind evil thoughts, evil thoughts, evil thoughts, evil thoughts. Evil th- Guard your heart. Be upstanding, everybody. Thank you for watching Udeme Fruitful Channel.